Good morning. Hi, Ann. Hey, have you heard about that rumor? A student from the next class fainted in the courtyard yesterday evening. Huh? That happened? Yeah, the student was brought to the nurse's office and regained consciousness soon, but... We're all wondering if it could have been the handiwork of a ghost. You heard that rumor before, right? About the female ghost in the courtyard? I don't know the details, but I have heard the rumors. But then again, ghosts don't exist, right? That's what I hope. Aren't you afraid of ghosts? Nope. After all, they don't exist. Hey there, everyone! Morning! Hey, Mizuki! Morning to you! Didn't know you were coming in today. I felt like coming to school, so I did. Anyway, what's everyone talking so excitedly about? Ah, uh, yes. The rumor about the ghost in the courtyard. Someone fainted there yesterday, and everyone's wondering if the ghost could have done it. Ah, I know about that rumor, too. Even though you never come to school? <laughs> I'm super sensitive to rumors of any sort, see? Doesn't seem like you know all the details, then? Yeah, I don't know what kind of ghosts and stuff. Not that I'm interested. Allow me to give you a special rundown. There's no need. That day, a female student was passing through the courtyard in order to run an errand for a teacher. The courtyard was empty because it was evening. Yet, the student could hear a woman wailing. She was probably just imagining things. Maybe it was actually the voice of someone doing club activities. If only. Did you know that the courtyard of this school used to be a cemetery? No way! The wailing sounded soft at first, but then it got louder and louder until it felt like there was someone right next to her. <sighs> the student steeled herself and turned around, but there was no one there. Then, as she was breathing a sigh of relief, she saw it. S saw what? A pale white hand protruding out from the ground, wrapped around her ankle. And just like that! <gasps> the girl fainted there and then. And when she woke up, she was lying on a bed in the nurse's office. The end! That means the student next door really fainted in the courtyard because of that ghost? <laughs> Wait a minute. Why is your face so pale? <gasps> Are you maybe actually afraid of ghosts? No, no, no way. Never. <laughs> oh, really? Hey, uh, by the way, do you think you could help me out with something after school today? The teacher asked me to run an errand, but it's gonna take a while for me to do it by myself. I'd appreciate some help. Errand? Well, I, I don't have anything going on after school today, so I, I don't mind. Thank you. See you after school then. Oh, 
of all the times to be at the courtyard, it just had to be right after hearing that creepy story. We're supposed to go to that store in there. Hmm, isn't it a little too quiet here? Huh? Is it? It seems normal to me. Anyway, what did the teacher ask you to do? That storeroom's where the equipment for the sports clubs are being kept. <sighs> Mizuki? Hey, why the sudden silence? Shh! Did you hear that? A woman's voice? Huh? It has to be from someone from the sports clubs! It's not! Listen! Those... Uh, uh, sounds... And... The sounds are getting closer! Huh? You're joking, right? I don't hear anything at all! No! On! There's a white hand around your ankle! Huh? What? I'm... I'm... I'm fine? <laughs> I knew it. You're terrified of ghosts. <laughs> oh, man. I never thought I'd see the day where I'd be hearing On go... <laughs> oh, you tricked me! Yups. That story was totally made up by yours truly. Why, you... I see. See, Ahn's afraid of ghosts, huh? <laughs> Everyone needs to know about this! Are they all still in the glass room? Hey, stop it! Don't go around spreading strange rumors! Stop, I said! 